Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make this floral painting in watercolors. Uh, so to start with, we need some sort of craft paper, a thick one, this is the one that I'm using, nothing expensive or fancy. It's going to function as a mask for the heart shape that we have in the middle of our painting. I'm folding the paper in half because I want to get a fully symmetrical uh, heart shape so I'm going to draw half of it and then cut it out using a scissor. I'm happy with the shape of the heart and the size and we'll start preparing the paper as usual I tape the edges to prevent from warping when adding too many layers of water and I want to find the middle point uh, for better placement of the heart now I'm going to use a paper tape to stick the heart to the paper um, and you could actually, instead of doing this, use a masking fluid as I have shown in one of my other videos. Uh, but at this point, I didn't have one and this was the easiest solution that came to my mind and worked out. For our flowers, I will mostly be using a mop brush. This one is from Winsor & Newton and a round brush from Da Vinci. So now I'm wetting the paper and pressing down uh, the heart as you can see because I don't want any water to go under the shape and I want to keep that area clean from any paint or water. So this is pretty important, take your time and don't rush things. So while the paper is still wet, we will start dropping our colors. I'm using very light ones, uh, yellow and corals and just let them spread um, and blend naturally. At this point I managed to bring in some blue or green paint into my uh, brush. I don't know how that happened but I didn't want to cut it out. If this happens just use a clean uh, paper towel and remove it and you can add even more water to wet the paper even more to make it easier to uh, remove the mistakes and this is especially possible if you are working with a cold pressed paper it's much harder from my experience on the hot pressed ones Now that the paper has dried completely, we will start painting in our flowers. Uh, this is an abstract uh, flower painting technique. Pay attention to the way I hold the brush. Don't rush it, take your time and just have fun.
As I'm building up my layers, I realize that I need to add more contrast in the middle uh, so that when we remove uh, the heart mask, uh, the part in the middle will stick out a bit more. Contrast is super important. And for that, I will go over very lightly and add a bit more paint. And I use a paper towel to remove the hard edges. So similar to what I did with the background layer, um, I'm darkening the flowers as I go. I let it dry using my hair dryer and then adding more layers. This way I create depth, also create this balance so that you don't end up with super dark um, paints and details. So uh, here I decided to add some details, but I wasn't happy with it. And again, this is the way I fix the mistake, uh, wetting the paper with the bigger brush and lifting up, lifting up some paint because I felt like uh, those lines got too dark. It was uh, distracting from everything else in the painting. Now we're almost done and it's time to remove the tape. Always make sure to heat the tape with the hair dryer to soften it. Uh, it makes it uh, much easier to remove. And now I'm fixing the edges by adding very lightly uh, some paint with my smallest brush. As you can see, I've also added some green leaves, which I forgot to record. Uh, sorry for that. But our painting is done and I hope you enjoyed watching this tutorial.